this ScreenFlow 10 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a transition or fade in, fade out um, an audio file within the timeline. So you can see here, I've got my two files within my timeline. I've got video file, and then up here, I've got my audio file. So in order to enable this, I just press the V key, and that's how you can enable or disable anything in your timeline. Now, at the start, the music just immediately plays. And then at the end, the music just immediately drops off and what I want to do is I want to add a transition to this video so in order to match that transition fading in fading out I want the audio to do the same so first thing I want to do I want to go to the start of my timeline because that's where I want my audio file to be silent and then I'm going to reduce in the inspector the volume down to zero and then I click action so now you see in my timeline I get this little yellow action box if I now move my timeline up let's say I want it to increase that duration over one and a half seconds. I'm then gonna move this back to 67% and move this action box up to meet that in the timeline. So now, over that duration, my um, audio file will fade in. And then all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reverse that action at the back end over whatever many seconds I want it to add the action box, drag it down to the end of the timeline, zero, and then come over here, drag the action box to extend over the duration of that period that I want it to work over. So now if I select the video in my timeline, right click on the video and select add starting and ending transitions, drag those transitions up to meet the audio transitions, and then play through this video. The audio matches nicely with the fade in, fade out. Hope this tutorial's helped you out. If you'd like to see me do any specific ScreenFlow 10 um, tutorials, please let me know in the comments below. Take care. Catch you all soon. Bye.